People love ETFs. In the last few years, ETFs have been selling like hotcakes. An ETF is an exchange traded fund. That means it trades on the exchange just like if you were to buy an equity or something. It's going to it's trade at the exact same time that exchange is open. It's going to have a whole kit and caboodle of funds inside, little stuff. It's a mutual fund, basically. It's a mutual fund with fun different names, and it's got a different, probably, wording for the MER. And it's like I would imagine mutual funds were in the 80s when the Magellan Fund was going crazy at Fidelity. Everybody was in it. Everybody's in exchange traded funds. July ETF inflows $27 billion moved into ETFs in July. Year to date, that's $273 billion. That's a lot of billions have moved into ETFs. That puts us only $13 billion shy of ETF inflows from the record year. Do you want to know when the record year was? Considering people like ETFs a lot recently, it was last year. Last year was the year, and we're 13 billion shy of that right now. Equity ETFs are up 18.8 billion in this 27 billion, and uh, fixed income ETFs, so obviously our equity ETFs are, again, things that are trading. Uh, your fixed income is going to be bonds, so on and so forth, uh, 12 billion. So you, you're getting still where people are obviously in equities quite a bit more than they're in any kind of fixed income, even though fixed income does have quite a bit there. That's a pretty big percentage, especially for a boom period for fixed income to be that much. But people love ETFs. If your ETF's doing well, I would imagine it probably is. Uh, <laughs> in a market like this, it's pretty tough not to be with interday and all-time highs on every every uh, benchmark you could imagine it, it is what it is you're going to be doing well so i'm sure your inflows are doing excellent etfs they're not the worst thing in the world so obviously look into it research um, don't listen to me go consult a professional financial advisor you want to do all the due diligence make sure you're totally comfortable you've you know make sure you've covered all your bases it's your money you worked really hard to earn it so let's make sure you protect it um financials tech and healthcare are the things that are up the most those are the ones that are really driving the etf growth and the material etfs are the things that are down um that kind of is what it is i mean obviously tech's going to be something that's ripping and roaring when things are doing really well there's a lot more there's a lot more demand when there's more money to go around why wouldn't you spend more money in r&d if you were a tech company to try to get new stuff on the marketplace because people have extra money so they're going to go up they're going to spend that little little bit of extra money. So there you go. July inflows of ETFs, $27 billion. We're 13 billion shy of an all-time record, and we're only sitting on the 3rd of August. So ETFs are doing quite well. How are your investments doing? Let me know. Subscribe. Wall Street Breakdown.